viewers welcome to my channel gyan knowledge hub in this video we'll discuss the question answers and back exercises of chapter 2 class 7 touchpad advanced features of excel so let us start the video but before that if you are new on the channel please subscribe it so first of all we'll do the rapid fire the multiple choice questions and the first question is which of the following allows you to visually display data in different formats and the answer is chart where is the sort and filter command present home we sort a to z option to sort text when we apply filter feature small arrows appear near column headers which of these is not a category used in conditional formatting it is a to z now next is true false excel can arrange data in ascending order only no it is false you cannot sort more than one columns at a time in a selected range of cells it is again false the add level butter is available under the insert tab false sorting can also be done through sort and filter group under the data tab it is true conditional formatting only used with numeric data it is again true now next is fill in the blanks dash chart is used to compare values across categories it is column chart dash is used when data is to be sorted on the basis of more than one criteria custom sort the conditional formatting option is available in styles group under the home tab color scales is a feature available in conditioning conditional formatting filters are used to separate required data from a set of data so these were the fill in the blanks and now we'll do the short answer questions first question is what is pie chart it is a circular chart divided into sectors where each sector shows the relative size of each value it always shows only one data series it is useful when you want to emphasize on a significant element to so, pie chart kaisa hota hai circular hota hai aur uske beech mein partitions ki hoti hai divisions ki hoti hai to show only one data define sorting sorting of data means to organize the data in ascending or descending order excel allows to sort both numeric and textual data to sorting kya hoti hai sorting ka matlab hota hai organize karna data ko ya ascending order mein ya descending order mein aur ye numeric aur textual dono hi data mein possible hai How do you remove filters? तो filters को कैसे remove कर सकते हैं To remove filters, click anywhere in the worksheet and repeat steps to apply filters. The filter arrows in the front front of column headers will disappear and the hidden rows will reappear. So this is how we can remove filters. नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज विच कमांड इज यूज टू हाइड अन इम्पॉर्टेंट डेटा फिल्टरिंग डेटा इज यूज टू हाइड अन इम्पॉर्टेंट डेटा नाउ नाउ वी कम टू द लॉन्ग आंसर टाइप क्वेश्चन डिफाइन एनी टू टाइप्स ऑफ चार्ट प्रोवाइडेड बाय एक्सेल सो वी राइट द फर्स्ट वन विल बी द लाइन चार्ट it is used to show trends over a period of time it is similar to plotting a graph on a graph paper with its values on x and y axis it it uses connecting dots to display trends over a period of time so this is a line chart and the next one is column chart it is used to display the data in the form of vertical bars it is used to show the changes in data over a period of time or comparison among the different data items the categories 
are represented on the horizontal axis and the values are represented on the vertical axis next question is what is the difference between sorting data and filtering data so you will put a line in between and write sorting data on one side and filtering data on the other side so sorting of data means to organize the data in ascending or descending order this you have already done and filtering data means to filter unwanted data from a set of data clear next question write the names of the criteria on the basis of which conditional formatting can be applied in excel so the various criteria are highlight cell rules top bottom rules data bars color scales and icon scales right next one write the steps to apply custom sort feature so the steps to apply custom sort feature are select the range of columns to be sorted click on the sort and filter command from the editing group under home tab a drop down list appears next click on the custom sort option from the drop down list the sort dialog box opens check my data has headers check box if the selected columns have a heading at the top click on the sort by box and select the column header according to which you want to sort the data in case we have selected client name header click on the sort on box and select cell values option click on the order box and select the a to z or z to a option in this case we have selected a to z option click on the add level button at the top of the sort dialog box to add another column to sort in this case we have added amount billed column तो ये ये जो केस हम ले रहे हैं ये वो केस है जो बुक में आपके एग्जाम्पल में दिया हुआ है क्लिक ऑन दी ओके बटन राइट सो दीज वर दी क्वेश्चन आंसर्स नाउ वी कम टू दी एक्टिविटी पार्ट सुमन वांट्स टू प्रेजेंट द इंफॉर्मेशन इन दी फॉर्म ऑफ अ चार्ट शी हैज अ डेटा ऑफ सिंगल सीरीज एंड द ग्राफ मस्ट शो रेलेटिव सर्कुलर साइज ऑफ ईच वैल्यू विच चार टाइप मस्ट शी यूज ही शुड यूज pie chart next john is preparing a list of students with their marks obtained in exams he wants to arrange the data in ascending order according to the students names suggest him a feature of excel which helps him to helps him in doing his work quickly so the answer is sorter so children that is all for this chapter very soon i'll be uploading the next chapter also so stay tuned and if you like the video please press the button of like and share